Welcome to the Future Minerals Forum 2024 Ministerial Roundtable. More than 80 governments, multilateral organizations, NGOs and associations are gathered to act on the potential of the mineral sector for generating prosperity for host countries and the world. Together we can maximize the potential of supplier countries to help the world achieve its future ambitions and the key to our success lies in effective collaboration and cooperation. It is inspiring to see the progress that we have made. That mining is the lowest ranked industry for trust. A reliable investment climate is essential. The Kingdom can play a very crucial role in uh, being a leader and bringing the world of uh, mineral players together. I think it's high time that we also, and in Morocco, we have a couple of experience when it comes to bringing in the informal sector and the artisanal sector in, in, in the mining industry. Which is that if you want to go fast, you go alone. But if you want to go far, you go together. That the right environmental, social and governance standards can happen faster and can give us the scales of the minerals that our world needs so that we can move to the energy transition. Distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen, welcome you all to the Future Mineral Forum 2024. I am delighted to announce that our estimated estimation for the King Kingdom's untapped mineral potential has increased from 1.3 trillion to 2.5 trillion, an increase of 90%. There is not a lot of time for talking. We have deadlines to hit, <clears throat> KPIs to hit, in order to achieve our, our objectives for 2030. Try to understand and to recognize the difference. They see the importance of supply chains and critical minerals. This is part of the energy transition. It's a fundamental change. You need to get the right energy for the uh, uh, mining. Please be long-term consistent policy. And as much as Saudi Arabia has done an incredible job, frankly, which is why forums like this are so important. All important countries in this global economy have to work together. There's a need to cooperate and there's a need to help each other out. We will continue to do that. The future of steel is here. Saudi Arabia is almost my home now because it's my fifth time already here. <laughs> Less than Welcome. two years. <laughs> 1.3 trillion dollar ila 2.5 in 2016 today. Let me start by thanking the kingdom for hosting the forum. The kingdom today is a bigger player on many fields, many sectors. Investment of more than 4 billion rials to support the mining industry. To be responsible, you've got to be accountable. To be accountable, you've got to be transparent. Inshallah, we'll do this with Aramco and we'll really create limitless free global warming energy for all of the 8 billion of our people on this planet. You want to do the renewable yourself? Come and do it. You want to do the hydrogen yourself? Come and do it. You want to export it via pipeline? Please do. You want local partners? We're here. We have quite a few national champions that can be partnered with you. And you recruit Saudis because the economic benefit will be here. Welcome to the 2024 Future Minerals Forum announcement ceremony, marking a momentous occasion signifying commitment to collaboration. You need to communicate with investors, you need to communicate with, with financiers to make sure that they all work together. To make sure that the energy transition is not only happening in developed countries, it is also happening in developing. We would love to work with other nations to develop those resources, to share our expertise, our technology. Minerals need to come from new jurisdiction, and Saudi Arabia is a new jurisdiction. Congratulations to the country and the leadership for the vision that they've shown in bringing everyone together. Something very unique and quite special. Riyadh is the place of the gathering of the family of mining. Thank you, our extended family. Special appreciation for our sponsor who believed in the cause of this event. 
please do more. Please continue to be positive. Thanks again for everyone for their contribution and see you next year.